If you want me to be honest, bro, Ski Mask, the slump god, does it pretty well, too. If you, like, listen to his shit, like, X's partner, bro, before like, X died and shit, like, bro, go and listen to Ski Mask, the slump god, and you'll you'll hear, like, small, small remnants of Nas and, like, Jay's, like, fast up, speed up flow, because, like, on modern beats, too, bro, fucking, like, I'm not, bro. You won't, you won't, you won't. You won't like the content, just listen to the technique. Because Ski Master Slump God is very much a nigga who just talks about partying, fucking your bitch, da 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 da, shit like that. that. Shit he do. No, he, he, really, he really does everything that he says he does. Right. Did, did you pick yet? Yeah, like, what? which one is your favorite, bro? Like, come on, bro. I've been, I've been He's about scared, dog! This is a debate. I've been going on in my head. Uh, I'm, I'm, I'm going to say my piece, then. Yeah, North hit it. I'm going to say. I'm going I'm 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 to say mine. Uh, I'm reserving my answer. For one, we, we, we really, we had this conversation, like, about Nas and the standard that Nas has been held to. The standard that he's been held to and is still in people's top five is because of that album. 20 years, bro. Yeah, it's, be, it's because of that album. That album was a dope album, but that album is the four 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 album. What what is? The like the content, like how of what? Alright, I'm gonna say like the four 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 album, right? No, nah, aromatic. <laughs> like this like the the over people here. Yeah, like it yeah, is you know what I'm saying? Like with that, all right. Yeah, like it, it, it's it's that's what type of album that was, but it was a great album. It was, and, and it was very well put together. And he was only seventeen. Yeah, it was exactly. very. And the thing about that is, bro, when Nas dropped that, when you drop an album like that for your day, but that's what album, that's what make it timeless. People have been so hard and, on him to top that since he dropped. But that's anybody. Let's look at let's look at Fifty. When Fifty dropped his album, look how many numbers it did. Yeah, the uh, Richard Dottrian. Followed up Power Dollar would get Richard Dottrian, and that shit was crazy. Nah, but that nah. What I'm saying is, when he dropped get when when he dropped that, it went like what? Damn near diamond or some shit. It like, went platinum first week. No, nah, everything. No, nah, that's what I'm saying. Like it, it went crazy. So then it's like okay, like his next album. Now you're getting held to that standard. Right. And now platinum. Massacre is one of my favorites. Massacre, but went you got to look first week. Yeah, but that. That getting compared to Get Richard Die Trying was no comparison and sell, but it was great sales. It was great sales, but people. What? What, what you mean? The massacre, massacre is so much better than Get Richard. No, Dye that's Trying. not what I'm saying. Oh, okay. I said he got. No, he. No, I'm saying he got held to that standard okay, okay. of the Get Richard Die Trying with so so many records, so like ten million records. That's so many. You know what I'm saying? Albums. So then when you come back and you sell one, two million records, you did great. That's a great, you went platinum. Right. Yeah. But everybody looking like, uh, you only sold two million this time. I mean, <laughs> right. I you know what I'm went saying? platinum right. the first week, though. Yeah, but what you, you getting held to a standard from your, your, your greatest work. Yeah, true. That's why they say you want, you, you as good as your last fight. Yeah, um, what was Nas' second album? Um, um, it wasn't still mad. No, I, I just want to point out that Nas calling an album Stillmatic is the dumbest move I've ever heard in my life. That like, dope, it's still that a stupid ass move. Okay, I'll give that to you, but I, like, I promise you it is. it's still like that. Now, that's a stupid album. But as far as what, what was the other one? Reasonable doubt. What? The the other album I was talking about. Yeah, yeah reasonable okay, doubt over Illmatic. No, yeah. Uh, yeah, reasonable Ooh. doubt. Like, reasonable doubt was a great album. Like it was a great album. A great album. I don't think it was better than Illmatic. So you're, you side with Illmatic. Personally, I'm a, Illmatic. I'm a Jay Z fan. I'm not even a Nas fan. Oh shit! Really? I I fuck with Nas, but oh, Nas shit. is not that consistent for me. Wow. I respect him, but he's not that. He's not. You don't yeah, put him in the same lane as but, Nah, because for one. Whole been consistently dropping hits. Fourteen career. number ones. Yeah, his whole career. Fourteen. Yeah, his whole career. You know, what I'm and and, and Nas still. Real quick. Well, if you want to compare Nas and Jay Z, because I, I just pulled them up. Yeah, you can't compare the two. The other day, so <laughs> I don't think. Yeah. Yeah. Um, some people actually I've heard argue 
uh, his second album, it was written. Some people say it's better than Illmatic. Which I actually, I, I actually that. like the I album. It was written, but it's not better than Illmatic. Please don't stop it. No, it's, it's, stop. But it's a type of it's a type of music that you that you're into because it's like even when you talk about a Jay Z, you talk about a Jay Z album and like his blueprints did so well. And then you got an album like the four four, f- yeah. Then you got an album like the four four four, which I love. I love that album so much. Yeah, like I I love the album, but that album just wasn't what people was really interested in. The right, the I mean, majority of the rap though. Yeah, because of it, right? Because of the mumble rap shit. Like. I don't wanna go Let's get it. Let's keep in mind that I haven't listened to all of Nas's discography or all of these. I, I can't. I can't in get in. And Hove hasn't failed. Yeah, no, I can't get in. Pass or fail? Ten. Pass. Yeah, that's a. Um, it was written. Uh, half a pass. pass. Classic. Pass. <laughs> he said <laughs> half a uh, pass. I am. To me, fail. Like, yeah. Actually, New York State of Mind Part Two. Craziest beats I ever heard. DJ Premier is one of the best producers, but and there's a couple there's a couple quotables on there, but but that's still a classic. flop to you. Still classic. It is still what you're talking about the whole album. Yep. I am. It still is classic. A classic. It is a classic. I'm gonna let you guys hit this one because I'm not. He's got he's got some shit on there. Like he's got um he's got hate me now, which that's an amazing song. Right. Nas is like. He's got That's an amazing That's a, song. Yeah, I love, I love the album. Thing, only thing I hate about Hate Me Now is the video because Diddy was in it. And I hate that Diddy is one of Nas's influences. Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> like, that makes no <laughs> sense to me, bro. Not like, not Diddy not is such a bitch-made ass person. But, like, Nas Diddy, looks Diddy, up to him, Diddy, for real. Diddy, Diddy, Diddy right. smacked the shit out of Drake, though. I'm not... <laughs> like, I'm about to say, y'all, you talk about Diddy a gangster for real. All right, so I'm giving I am... I'm giving I am a um, that that no. nigga was holding the cross. Then he was in the background dancing. I can't. <laughs> 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 Yo, all right. So Nostradamus. The connection. <laughs> the connected motherfucker. Nostradamus is a pass. Um, Nostradamus is a pass. Cause just because of the fucking name. That's right, fine. That talk to me. That album talk to me. Shoot him up. Just shoot him up. What? Um, and uh, Stillmatic is a pass. Stillmatic is a is fail. Man, I'm here. I'm, I'm, I'm just well, listening. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Um, they're still classics. Yeah, they classics. The lost tapes was so hard. So hard. Let me ask you something. Have any of these albums flopped? Like, have any of them have not? Has any of Nas's albums well, not that's, reached that's platinum hard. status? Jay Z, when they were beefing, Hove used to say like, what did he said that one line? He said, "We dropped Illmatic. That's a." That's a uh, one hot album every ten year average or something. That's what he said on Takeover. That was one of his most classic, notable. Books. Okay, but the, my question is: Has any have any Nas of Nas's Nas albums flopped? Takeover is a classic. Which Nas I is a classic. Nas is a classic itself. When you when you when you when you when you, when you speak on his albums, they're classics. Right. When you bring up his name, it, it, it has it it it. it it's classic, everything he does. Classic now, if you compare him to other people, that's when he starts losing credibility because it's right. who do you put him up against. You're forced to put him up with the greats like Hov, who just had consistency the entire time. Is that the only right. difference between them, though? Are we, are we that's a big difference. Yeah, that's a big difference. That, that's, that's a, a big huge difference. big difference. Is that the only lying factor there? Like, well, just because Hov I, don't, consistency? I don't I mean, think Jay-Z is a better rapper than us. I agree. Obviously, way more consistent. Jay Z's one of the most consistent artists. Period. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And he never and, and ever has to evolve. And and a five six survivor too. <laughs> <laughs> That's what I love about Jay though. Like Jay never ever really has to evolve. Like the only time you ever really like heard him spitting new flows is on Magna Carta and watched. No, nah, but that's the thing. The thing is because he was so consistent. Yeah. Like if Nas was the same, had the same consistency, it it would be the same. Honestly, like, but, so right now, yeah. but right now, that that's being held to. If Nas was more consistent, we would, we would revere him as a. As a if Nas was more consistent, hits. Yeah. Like more radio I'll hits like Jay. If Nas was yeah. more consistent, he'd have. To, right? you know, I don't think he's not that kind of. He's rapper. not a. Yeah. He's just true to himself and he didn't give a fuck. But now he'll put something now. It, it, it's like what I say with. He's just one of them artists that is going to be his. 
type of artist like that's not going to you know so when he puts something out he's putting it out because this is this is for my fan base making tracks with Pharrell yeah. Hope is yeah. making tracks with Linkin Park yeah like, you know what I mean yeah. like, he's out there doing things like yeah. mixing it up you know balancing everything but that was the reason just staying true to Nas R- right and his fan base right right I think I think the fact that Nas does that makes him a better rapper than Jay honestly because Nas just like Jay doesn't really ever have to evolve, but you can hear the effort that Jay puts in to be more commercial. Nas, be on a DJ it, exactly. Album or, you know I mean? But Nas is on a DJ nah, album as well. It's, it's staying relevant. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? Exactly. Like, in, in, in order, in, in order, in order to stay relevant, you had to adapt because it's like if you have, let's say, Jay with the amount of time that he been out. And let's say other rappers that was out during the same time that he was out, like they're gone. If you couldn't adapt, you're gone. Right. You're gonna be considered as an old school rapper. Right. Yeah, facts. You know what I'm yeah, saying? You know what? If you really, if you really think about it, Jay Z has gotten respect from '80s cats, '90s cats, probably '70s too. '80s cats, '90s cats, 2000s, two thousands, two. You know, Big Daddy King gives Jay Z his credit. And today, young kids know yeah. who the fuck Jay Z. Yeah, is. yeah. That's because of yeah. Kids about Nas, they probably don't. I, I'm yeah. not saying they don't or know who he is or respect him, but I bet Jay Z gets more respect as an artist. But I think he do, he do he do. do that. Yeah, well, more that more people more, more people know Jay than Nas. Yeah, Ill-Mag that's true. Is a better album than Reasonable Doubt, and I hate to say that because I fucking love Reasonable Doubt. Yeah, yeah. I do too, bro. Florida it's such a great album. Yeah. Top of my list, but Illmatic is better, but Jay Z is a better artist. Yeah, I think I think.